Hey everyone, so yes, this will contain spoilers for the finale of Ninjago Hands of Time, and it's kind of just based on more of what we've seen, uh, more than what we've, we've completely understood. Again, they did release in um, another language, so I'm here to, you know, kind of ask you guys and wonder, do you guys think, because you, it, again, spoilers for, um, you know, what is to come if you don't want to know, if you're waiting, you don't want to turn this off, but um, at the end in the finale, Sensei Wu, like, he saved Kai and Nia and all that stuff, and he pushed Kai and Nia out of the time travel vortex thing that they were in, and, you know, he got Kai and Nia back, you know, he gave them the blade or something like that, I'm gonna have to watch it again, exactly, but he saved them, and he stayed behind in this time vortex thing with, um, Crux and Acronix. And at the end, you know, I think we had seen it where the ninja had accepted Lloyd as, you know, he's the new master, you know. And then, like, the last scene or something like that of the finale was Sensei Wu. And it was him looking up, you know. He's just, like, there in that time vortex traveling thing. I know, it's really weird. But, you know, they, they traveled through the time and stuff. The time twins did with their mech. So... My question is, could Sensei Wu is, Wu, is Sensei Wu stuck there forever? Um, is he permanently stuck there, or is he able to get out? Now, or will he just be stuck there forever, or will he get out? Because, as you know, the Time Twins did get out. Crux and Acronix did get out. So, it is a possibility that they can get out, that he can get out. But, I, I guess the question here is, will he get out, or will he just end up staying in there? Now, I have actually thought this before. None of us want to see Wu go, but I could almost, just almost, you know, in, in going one way in the show, you know, one thought of how the show could move on could be, you know, sen or Lloyd becoming like the new kind of, not sensei exactly, but like the new master, um, you know, the, the ninja's new master, you know, the main one in control. Um, their new, like, main, he's already been the leader, but you know what I mean, their new master, and I feel like that could progress the show very well if they did it right, and uh, we all like Sensei Wu, Sensei Wu is awesome, but I don't like Sensei, like, Garmadon, you know, they got rid of him, and it doesn't seem like they're going to be bringing him back, and they got rid of him for certain reasons, you know, um, Lloyd and his story, involvement, and all that stuff, and, um, you know, him saving Ninjago in the season four finale. So they got him rid of him for a few reasons and stuff. And it has kind of progressed the story. So if Sensei Wu is gone, I could see it progressing the story in different and new ways. So we don't want to see him go. But I, I do feel like if he doesn't make it back, if he doesn't get back, um, that, that something like that could happen again. So, but... Do you guys think that Sensei Wu is stuck in this time vortex thing that we see in the season 7 finale? Or do you think the ninja will somehow find a way to get him out?